Mozambique is a country with a rich tapestry of history, culture, and potential. However, since its independence, the country has faced underdevelopment of its infrastructure. Therefore, the country is gearing up for infrastructural transformation through several ongoing mega-projects that mark Mozambique's journey to becoming a fully developed country. Notably, Mozambique has the potential and the resources to realize these mega-projects. But what are these mega-projects? You may ask. From LNG to transportation transformations, and from infrastructural wonders to sustainable energy ambitions, it's all here, waiting for you to discover. Let's dive right in. 7. Mozambique LNG Project It was in 2010, off the northern coast of Mozambique, that the country made a discovery of natural gas. Fast forward to 2019, and the country has made more discoveries. Therefore, the government is investing $20 billion in the Mozambique LNG project. Notably, this project is a game-changer for Mozambique's economy as it involves investing in a liquefied natural gas plant with a massive 12.88 million tons per year production capacity. And guess what? It's set to be a key player in global LNG supply, ranking third with 75 trillion cubic feet of recoverable gas and a guaranteed 120-year resource life. The project will be located 40 kilometers off Mozambique's coast. Moreover, Total Energies, the world's second-largest LNG player, is the main investor in the project. The company is working hand-in-hand -hand with Mozambican communities and government officials to ensure the responsible and sustainable running of the project. 6. Pemba Economic Zone Nestled in the northeastern tip of Pemba lies the Michawini Free Economic Zone. The project covers 808.8 .8 hectares and is just a stone's throw away from Kawani Seaport and Chake Chake Airport. Notably, the project includes road networks, a sewage and drainage system, and power generation facilities. Also, the Michawini Free Economic Zone is fueled by cutting-edge ICT facilities. Moreover, the Pembalachinga Integrated Development Corridor Special Agro-Industrial Processing Zone SAPZ, isn't just about infrastructure, it's about agricultural productivity, agribusiness, and livelihoods since the project's heart lies in Nyasa province, where the land is fertile. Furthermore, this five-year project is set to span 2022 to 2026 and comes with a price tag of UA 32.79 million. And guess what? The government of Mozambique is chipping in with UA 2.0 million in contributions. The project implementation unit finds its home in the Ministry of Industry and Commerce, while the Department of Economic Activities takes charge at the provincial level. 5. Beira Port Expansion As of 2000, the container terminal at the port of Beira was handling around 35,000 containers. Fast forward to 2021, and that number skyrocketed to a staggering 278,000 containers. Therefore, the port urgently needs expansion to manage the increasing demand. The port of Beira, nestled in the stunning Sofala province, is gearing up for a makeover. Notably, the project aims to increase the port's container handling capacity from a mere 300,000 to a whopping 700,000 TUs per year. Moreover, the expansion includes putting up smart space to make sure containers are stored with care and efficiency and ensuring easy access. This project will provide a lifeline to a regional market hungry for growth. For instance, the markets in Zimbabwe, Zambia, the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and Malawi are all to benefit from the project. 4. Rovuma LNG Project Rovuma Basin is rich in gas fields, with over 85 trillion cubic feet of natural gas reserves that are ready to fuel Mozambique's dreams. Notably, the Rovuma LNG project involves harnessing gas and making it reliable and affordable for the people of Mozambique. ExxonMobil is leading the charge on the onshore facilities, while ENI is taking the reins on upstream developments. The project will involve harnessing natural gases from three reservoirs in the Mamba complex. Furthermore, the Rovuma LNG project is set to construct two onshore LNG trains, each with a capacity of 7.6 million metric tons per year. The trains will be fed by 24 sub-sea wells. Overall, 
The Rovuma Basin project will lead to monumental growth and serve as a roadmap to making Mozambique a star on the global energy stage. 3. Tet Solar Power Project Mozambique is a land blessed with abundant sunshine, yet only 1% of its energy mix comes from solar power, with hydropower leading as the source of power. But during the dry season, the hydropower's capacity drops. Therefore, the government has been planning for solar power to step in. Notably, Mozambique plans to invest in solar power projects through public-private partnerships. Moreover, the Tet Solar Power Project occupies 950 hectares of land in Tet, and the plant is expected to produce about 300 megawatts of solar plus storage. First up, the plant will produce about 100 megawatts using existing infrastructure and then set up new infrastructure for the remaining 200 megawatts. 2. Matola Coal Terminal Expansion The Maputo port is a bustling gateway to the Gauteng Industrial Center and the mining hubs of Limpopo and Mpumalanga. Therefore, as a powerhouse resource that's not just fueling energy but driving economic engines, the Matola Coal Terminal is undergoing expansion. The project plans to increase the terminal's handling capacity from 7.3 million tons per year to around 12 million tons. Furthermore, the Matola Coal Terminal involves deepening the coal berth to a whopping 15.4 meters, which means Panamax vessels can now dock. And that's not all, the terminal's quay and ship loader are being expanded to accommodate more cargo. Notably, South Africa's Transnet SOC Limited joined hands with Mozambique and Swaziland to partner in the project and streamline coal exports. Overall, with two new berths standing tall, it will facilitate the handling of coal with the assistance of railway tracks, as it will consist of a sprawling terminal that's set to cover around 120 hectares. 1. In Hambane Oil Refinery this is the first cooking gas refinery born from the Ponde and Temane gas exploration projects. With 30,000 tons of cooking gas annually, the project will cut imports by 75%. Moreover, the project will involve the construction of the Temane thermal power plant, and with the World Bank backing its construction, the project will satisfy domestic consumption and supply outside the country, thus lighting up neighboring countries. Furthermore, the Inhambane oil refinery is part of a project worth over 760 million US dollars that, through the Temane transmission project, links the southern region's electricity network to the central and northern networks. Overall, over 3,000 Mozambicans will be potentially employed during the project's execution phase. The government's not just stopping here, they're paving the way for sustainable gas exploitation. Conclusion And there you have it. We journeyed through the monumental Mozambique LNG project, uncovered the Pemba Economic Zone, the Beira Port Expansion, the Rovuma LNG project, the Matola Coal Terminal Expansion, the Inhambane Oil Refinery, and the Tet Solar Power Projects, which are poised to transform Mozambique's infrastructure development. Are these ambitious plans realistic? Well, they're more than just plans, they're actions, they're determination, and their Mozambique's unwavering commitment to a better future. These megaprojects aren't just about infrastructure, they're about hope, potential, and the transformation of an entire nation. Thank you, amazing viewers, for joining us on this incredible journey of discovery. If you've enjoyed this exploration as much as we have, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video, and, of course, subscribe to our channel for more eye-opening content. See you in the video.